Okay, how's everybody doing out there? First of all, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Crystal Edge Technology Screens using Smart Technology Gain. Have a few updates. I got to plug in here really quick. Now, the Nano Screen Paint is coming out very soon. It's going to come in three colors. It's going to be absolutely amazing. Can be coated on just about anything you want, and will come with a free Wagner paint sprayer. <coughs> Excuse me, that's the 150. Also, two, um, we're still working on the graphic design labels for that. So it'll be launching on the 16th. If we get it done faster, then it'll be sooner. Um, we also have a new blackout cloth coming out. It's the same blackout cloth as the four nothing really different it's just one little strange detail to it can't tell you too much about that and also too we have another project we're working on which we'll be showing off today um, it is an add-on to enhance your home theater setup which you're gonna really love this package kit and what it comes with all right so uh, let's talk about our ultra 4k this is the Eclipse ultra 4k supreme I've done this same demonstration on the ti 47 downstairs at 13 feet back on a ViewSonic projector we are going to do this on the short throw projector if you're curious to see it on long throw, I can pull it back 14 feet, do the same thing all over again. Now, this is usually what most people will be going through who, own, who owns a projector. Keep in mind, we are around, let's see in time, we're around 11, 13 in the evening or a.m., evening, a.m., whatever. But anyway, so usually if you're around this time, you want to watch some TV, you want to watch sports or whatever you want to do, this is what your environment is going to look like. With our technology, it's something we don't have to worry about. Keep in mind, I've seen this demonstration with some, I'm just saying, I saw this demonstration, I've seen a lot of demonstrations, but I've seen a lot of demonstrations where individuals will try to make the screen look amazing in a full environment, but keep in mind, look at the size of the screen. As I said before, if the screen's a four by four or five by five, and the projector's fitting that image, that screen just perfectly, it just proves that either the projector's sitting too close because you can't see where the projector's sitting, or maybe the screen has been uh, focused in to fit that particular area and that causes the pixelation to push tighter together and gives you a sharper and more cl um, more clarity to your picture. On top of that, keep in mind if you're using a projector of 3,000 lumens, even 1,500 lumens, with a projector sitting that close, it doesn't make a difference if the door is open or not. You're still going to have a picture that's going to show up. All right, so as I sh I'm showing you, we have the short throw projector. Keep in mind we've done these demonstrations at 14 feet back on the long throw. Now. I'm going to show you how much physical light is going to hit the screen. Usually most people will have a window such as mine right next to your screen. This is something you are afraid of, but this is going to wreak havoc on your screen. Uh, keep in mind, I want to show you that my blinds are fully open. We're going to shut them again to show you how much physical light is hitting the screen. So we'll shut them again. There you go. And now we're going to open them again to show you how much physical light is actually hitting the screen with the blinds fully extended. Make sure they're fully extended. All right, so you see how much physical light is actually hitting our screen. Now we're gonna come over here, we're gonna open up the door. First things first, I'm gonna pull this back because I want light to travel from here onto the screen. Keep in mind, my screen does not sit behind the back of my door. So when I open up my door, light is going to come and hit the screen. Much like in the summertime when I will have this door open, I will have light hitting the screen. All right, so we got the window open here. We have a window open here. You can see how much physical light is hitting the screen. We're gonna remove our projector. Actually, our, um, it's blocking our projector, which is the menu. And we're gonna open up the door all the way up. All the way up so you can see how much light's coming in. Now keep in mind, as I said before, that our screen does not sit behind the door. Why in the world, even though it's a cloudy day, why would I wanna block all this beautiful ambient light coming into my environment just because I'm afraid it's gonna plague my screen? All right, so let's begin. Keep in mind, I did the same demonstration on the TI-47. Only difference is I did it with a projector that was around 13 feet back. We'll do it at 14 feet back later on in the day, or probably tomorrow morning if I can get some sunlight. And I want you to see, this is the physical light that's hitting this screen. Now we have our door open. Got a big wide door here. Plenty of light coming in. And look at the screen, look at the floor. Look how well lit the environment looks. And this is without the condensed lighting coming down on the screen. Now I'm gonna pause it right here. We're gonna come over here and we're gonna hit the condensed lighting. Right there, so we make sure we have enough light. Oh, that right, get it right the first time. All right, so there we are. We have the condensed lighting hitting the screen. Make sure you have plenty of light in here. Let's back it up a bit. All right, and let's begin. 
Now we have condensed lighting. That's how much light literally hits the screen over there. You see on the fireplace. Got the door open, lights on, and that's what this is what we get. Look how shiny that diamond looks. Now I'm going to shut my door here. Shut our door. Pull our curtains in. All right. Door shut. Now if I come over here, now mind you, this is without the extra um, light in the environment. This is with the blinds closed. Now this is my everyday lighting in my environment. This is what I'm getting. That's just to show you, this is what I'm getting from my everyday environment. All right, for my time runs out here, I'm Kenneth Burr from Crystal Edge Technology Screens using smart technology gain. I hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. I'd like to thank you all for watching and show you how amazing our screen paint is. Just look at this fully lit environment. This is just a normal, for me, this is a normal fully lit environment. Having my windows open is just the extra add-on. So I'll go back here a minute and just show you. That is just the extra add-on. Look how fantastic that looks. I'll hit my blinds again, so open my blinds all the way up again. Right there, look at the screen. And this is in a fully lit environment with the window open. I have no fears of having my window open because I don't have to worry about my screen washing out or fading out on me. Hope you enjoyed this video demonstration. I'd like to thank you all for your time.